Srinivasan Ramani led ERNet team at India's National Centre for Software Technology to set up Central Mail Switch and International Gateway. Yes, welcome. Thanks to the Internet Society and to the Internet Hall of Fame for having invited me here and honouring me. Um, I stand here as a representative of uh, a number of uh, groups of colleagues. Uh, the work that uh, was described uh, was a part of what I did as a part of the Indian Academic Network project called the Education and Research Network, ERDET, funded by the Government of India and supported by the United Nations Development Program. And it was perceived, uh, you know, it was conceived in a spirit of uh, networking for development, for developing countries everywhere. There was a excitement with the idea that developing countries needed computer networking technology uh, very badly. And they had, this technology had a very special meaning for them. And the academic community could be forerunners in adopting and adapting the technology and innovating on it and making it available to industry and to business. So it was part of this large program that I worked on this. We were fortunate, we were in Mumbai where there were excellent telecom facilities and I was the director of a National Center for Software Technology as was mentioned and therefore uh, we were Unix hackers and uh, with BSD Unix, uh, for which I paid a princely sum of $110 for, uh, you know, the reel came free, a reel of tape. And uh, with this $110 worth of BSD uh, Unix, we were able to get a lot done, get the suite of uh, computer networking suite running, and we were all set and ready for networking, but the telecom links were not there. So, uh, but Mumbai had the internet, not the internet, the international gateway for telecom, so it was not too difficult for us to get good telecom connections to the world, and we connected with the uh, Center Viscunde Informatic in Amsterdam. Uh, colleagues there were very kind enough to give us a connection, and we set up the first internet gateway in India. This was done by the uh, Yernet project team at the National Center for Software Technology, and uh, I, which I headed at the time. Uh, but more exciting than just the technology of getting a connection was working with six advanced institutes in India, the six uh, the IATs, as we call them, Indian Institutes of Technology, and uh, setting up connections between Mumbai and these six uh, IATs, and working with the six senior colleagues at all these locations, and with the Government of India team in Delhi, and working with the UNDP. So these were exciting times, and we got this work done, and we were able to train hundreds of students who went on to serve the industry and consult for the industry, pass the technology on to the industry. So this is the background to the uh, work that I was uh, involved in. And I thank all my colleagues in these teams at the National Center for Software Technology, which is now called, which is now a part of the uh, Center for the Development of Advanced Computing, CDAC. And also I thank the colleagues of the ERDET, particularly the six professors and the six IITs who cooperated with us, who were my partners, and with the Government of India. And an amazing uh, person who worked at the Government of India as our uh, interface with the government, Mr. Ramachandran, Ramakrishnan. Ramakrishnan was a senior government official, but he was more of an academic at heart, and he worked with us like an academic, And uh, but for him, I think we would have done very little in the uh, Yerdet project. I should also thank my wife, uh, Usha, who is here, and my mother, who is 99, and who will be the proudest when I go her and show her the certificate. Occasionally when I take an online course now and I pass the requirements, 
And I show her the certificate. She says, oh, get it framed. I want it on the wall here in my room. <laughs> and so at 98, I'm going to give her a framed copy of the certificate. She'll be very happy. <laughs> and with these words, I will conclude here. Thank you.